Hey, it's NHL Draft Day. Nobody covers trade deadlines, drafts, free agent frenzy, or hockey for that matter, like the pros at TSN. And here with a preview of uh, all of it is uh, TSN Bar Down digital content creator Eric Kirk. Eric, good morning. Thanks for being here. Morning, George. Thanks for having me. So let's. Uh, well, you know, TSN director of scouting Craig Button, usually on the button. He's he's got uh, Kingston Frontenac's Star Center Shane Wright going number one to Montreal in Montreal tonight. Is he a lock? And I don't want to. Do you think is he on the sort of McJesus and Tavares uh, potential pantheon there? So the funny thing is, we have Button taking right first overall, but Bob McKenzie taking Slavkovsky first yeah, overall. Yeah. So we've got two sides of the coin there. Me personally, I think it has to be right. You look at the guy, he really didn't get a chance to play in the OHL that much. He only played one and a half seasons, and that's just because he got exceptional status. Right. right? So his first season was uh, cut short due to the COVID break, and he was playing at a point-per-game clip higher than Tavares, mm. higher than a lot of these guys who we've seen get exceptional status. So if you're looking for a do-it-all center, it's really Shane Wright. He's phenomenal. He looked great in the CHL Top Prospects game, and I think that he's a lock for number one. So will Connor Geeky, brother of uh, Kraken Ford, Morgan Geeky, and Matt Savoy, where, where, let's talk about both of them. Where do they sort of slot top 10? Where, where may they land? I think both can land top 10. Two polar opposite players, especially when you compare Savoy to a player like Shane Wright, who's not really so flashy, mm. but he can do it all. Then you look at Savoy, lightning fast with the puck, silky smooth player, great hands, really just a phenomenal player to watch. And then Morgan Geeky is just a absolute horse. The guy is <laughs> massive and he will run you over <laughs> without a chance. He will do whatever he can to put the puck in the net and watching him play is phenomenal. So if you're looking for a big, tough power forward of the Tom Wilson type, yeah, Morgan Geeky yeah. is your guy. Good analogy. Yeah, he's just, he's like your prototypical Canadian hockey player, right? Like he's just, that's, he's the one you build. Um, Love what to about, have him uh, hate to play against him. Yeah, same. Um, American uh, Logan Cooley, he's up there, right? Yeah, it, it seems to be a consensus top three with Wright, Slavkowski, and Cooley. People aren't saying what they think the order is. I think it's going to go exactly in that order with Shane Wright, Slavkowski, and then Cooley. Um, but he is also a very nice player for the U.S. D DP. So let's wrap it up like, talking about team scouting for depth and leverage and maybe some trading chips. Leafs, Penguins, Coyotes. Yeah, you, you look at the Leafs and their first round pick, Virtually no chance they're cracking the roster this season. Yeah. So do they use their pick on a player or do they use it in some trade leverage? What do they do with it? You got questions with Jack Campbell. You got questions with Jake Muzzin. Yeah. What are you really doing with this pick? So Kyle Dubas will be very busy tonight. And then the Penguins, this is this is the tale of what their entire franchise is going to look like. If they use this pick tonight, they're essentially looking to rebuild here because you've got Malkin on an expiring contract. He's a free agent this year. Latang's a free agent this year. Crosby's not getting any younger. Yeah. So if they're not making a push to be competitive right now, then it might be the end for them. And then uh, Arizona, three picks in the first round. <laughs> you just got to take the best player available if you're Arizona at this point. You really just got to put your pride away and nail these picks because you've been bad for so long. You got yeah. three kicks at the can. Just take whoever is there that <laughs> you sure. think can improve your hockey team. So the big drafts tonight, and then next Wednesday, it's free agent frenzy July 13th on TSN. You are going to be one busy boy, Eric Kirk. Yeah? It should be fun. <laughs> it should be. Hey, thanks for giving us some time today. Appreciate it. Of course. Oh.